Okay, this is the main vertical element of a 5.8 ground plane that was for 27 megs or 11 meters. Now, what I'm what I'm uh, going to try and do is utilize it because it's been sitting in the garden for I don't know three years or so, maybe longer, doing nothing. So I've cleaned it up, and I'm going to try and utilize it for 160 and 80. And what I've done is I've made this out of uh, this coil out of uh, 12 mil OD copper pipe, which I picked up from the big green shed. Um, which is one of our uh, large suppliers here in uh, hardware stores in Australia. I won't say its real name. And uh, I've put, let's see if we can see that. I've soldered or brazed or whatever you want to call it, taps onto each um, coil part or whatever you want to say. And I've put a SO239 on there. Looks a bit dodgy because it is. And uh, I'm going to put this down the bottom in an enclosure down here somewhere. It's going to be vertical, obviously. And the element, I'm going to put a uh, coax in here. I'm thinking, I'm talking on my feet here, so I've got to work it out what I'm saying. Put a coax in here. Only the uh, the core goes to the to the element, and the rest, the uh, the braid of the coax goes down to uh, down to the ground. Or I'll put some uh, counterpoises up, um, and then I'll come off the bottom of the vertical element to one of the taps, and we'll see which one I, is better. Now, that's obviously not going to get to, well, pretty sure it's not going to get to 160, um, but we'll see. Because, so what I'm expecting I'll have to do is up the top, um, up here somewhere, I'll attach a bit of wire, so I'll come off here and go out horizontal, which I've got... Um, probably see a pole in there with a this is at the front of the house got a pole going up there and that's uh, that's for 40 meters so I can come out to there and I've got another pole up the back of the house as well which uh, can be utilized I've also got a um, a diamond CP5 multiband vertical in the garage, which isn't being used and doesn't wasn't much chop when I got it. So what I'm thinking is I might be able to utilise part of that, mainly the the uh, uh, what are they called the horizontal elements. If you want to call them that, it's got like a top loading cap. I might be able to put that on up the top here and play around, see what it does. Why not? You know, it's all good fun until someone loses an eye, then it's hilarious. So, there you go. All right, uh, let's see if I can give you a better look at this thing. That's a three meter bit of copper. 12 mil diameter. Just bent it around a bit of 100 mil poly pipe by hand. <laughs> Nothing special. I haven't done anything with copper before, so I'm just playing around and seeing what works and what doesn't. That's all part of it. There you go. Alright. Thanks for watching.